Hey uh, folks, how y'all doing? This is Con Ulrich coming to you again with another episode of Sky Shines Bedlam. I know it's been quite a while since we saw each other last, and in fact I'm really not going to be too concerned about how long that was because that just gets in, in the way of things. It's really not important, right? Alright, so we're just going to jump right back into it. It's interesting to note that there's a 2.0 patch coming our way. But as to what will be included in the 2.0 patch is a little bit up in the air. I have read that, um, oh look, it looks like we get some more oil, fantastic. Uh, I have read that some people have actually beaten the game and discovered that there's actually no end to the game. First of all, I don't know how anybody actually beats the game unless they're playing it easy. Ah, uh, this dude, okay. Something about blah 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 is basically some babbling in nincompoop. Wither and Wayne, blah blah blah. blah. I will take this from you. Neutronic tuning fork. Okay, this thing actually does do some good stuff for you. And we'll get to that elite in a little bit. I'm gonna continue to check this stuff out first. Uh, but yeah, someone has managed to actually get through all four stages of Viscera. And I can't even tell you... Whoa, this is new too. But I can't even tell you what that looks like, but apparently there's some sort of bug that prevents it from actually working correctly. The end, the end of the game, that is. Okay, so they're keys. Why not cut glass to get to the keys? Hooray! Oh, wow. Wow, okay. So we have something. I don't even know what we have necessarily, but we have something now. Crusade of 80 plagues. Mintronic. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, well, I'm gonna start going up and around all these maps to see if I can find other dozers in this particular run-through. I'm guessing that we should be able to get away with it. Okay, so we have... Looks like a lot of harmless rogue AI. I'll invite them to join us. Cool. Hooray! I have more power cells, which is what I, exactly what I need in this game. And another Wanderer. Okay, so if I give him Sanctuary... He might give me something. Cool. I'll take it. Uh, I'm gonna see if we can pick up this Elite. Don't know how well that's gonna go. It kinda depends who the Elite is, I'm sure. Ah, uh, Crowbar main. Okay, yeah, we can do this. Yeah, we can take care of this dude. No problemo, Chifo. Okay. My big issue is I'm trying to find a way to make all of my guys better. Let's bring a rookie gunslinger, see what happens. But at the same time, I don't want to go and give my guys a way to die. That would be very, very bad. If I unmask the sniper. Big stinking deal. I wonder if it's worth using the distillery. Probably not. That dude is not going to die anytime soon. But if he gets much closer, we're going to have a big problem. Okay. 
Now might actually be a time to do that. No, no. Maybe. Okay, so that's seven right there. So the dude does six damage, which means I need to find a way to make him not do damage to me. Which I think it is time then to actually use the drunk bus. Yes, it will make one of my men drunk as well. Unfortunate, but it's going to happen, I think. That's fine. Cool, so he's down, which means I have time to go running and pick up some other stuff, I think. Yikes. And you, my friend, are gonna duck back over here. Worth it. Pick up the power cells. Can you guys not do something like that? Because that's just rude, eventually. You know? Not a big deal. You can bolt for the hills. He might run up after you. Ah, oh, good. I'll take that. That works for me. Actually, it's not going to work for me, since he might kill me. Let's do that, so that way he will not die. So we used a lot of power cells. But we are able to come out without losing anybody. Which is important. And we have another elite, so I might as well pick him up, you know. Now I'm debating, do I go back to the south and try to make my way around? I think I will. I've been doing a little bit of research into how to get through this rather well. Or to, to kind of work. Great, so let me sabotage the entrance. Um, and people keep saying, well, basically going up and down and back and forth and kind of just leveling up people like crazy. So I don't know if that's going to work, but I'm going to try that out, you know? I think that might make me feel a little bit more secure. Okay, that's fine. We have more snipers to bring in. Bring out the trencher. Okay, that's actually a fair amount of dudes. Meat. And for some reason, I stopped working dudes working with them. What if I get away with charging up a little bit, taking a shot? You got a kill. You don't. You know what, let's give it a go. Hey. Works for me. Go ahead, charge me and hit me one time. Punk. Can't shoot you? Okay, cool. I was worried for a second. Really? That seems a little bit wasteful. Veteran. I mean, not that I'm really complaining, I suppose. Oh. 
just gonna book it to the side. Cause I don't feel like losing anybody on this map. Cause I am a healer. Like a healer healer, like I don't care that much about these guys, but just enough. To not take too many hits, you know? What if I get another level up on this? Crude. Eh, not worth it. Just die. Oh, I did. How about that? Okay, so I didn't pick up the power cells like I might have wanted to. But I'll take the book of the cog. And continue traipsing around all those random places. Explore the area. Rotter stepping onto some metal platform on the ground. Approach the platform. Interesting. <laughs> this is kind of funny. Here's some of that weird dark humor. Apparently. This could be awesome, actually. Let's, let's, try, it. let's try it. The body displacer. That sounds really quite impressive. I don't know if that's any good. In fact, I'm sure it'd probably make me want to cry. But I, that's that's actually that could be a game changer for this game. Well, not for, duh, for this game, but like game changer for these runs. Okay. So a bunch of sharpshooters. Let's see if we'll approach them. See if they say, "Hey, buddy." Oh, I heard about this. I, I, oh my gosh. Dang it. All right, I heard that there was actually an elite sniper. And I think I just blew the chance to pick her up. That's unfortunate. Okay. And now people are cyborgs instead. Okay, so now I have to defend stupid thing. Let's bring you along because I don't feel like losing anybody. Important. Let's see, how many kills do you have? You have two, you have nothing. Let's bring you along and try to get you a kill. Oh, it's going to be a heck of a lot worse. Four damage, you have six health, which means you are going to make yourself useful. Veteran. Hey, you do three damage. Cool, that's a kill. That's power cells. Viv. To make yourself useful. Five damage a pop. Might as well have you run up here. Pretend like I care. Yourself useful. He's fine to take two shots. Oh wow, he's not. Fantastic. Even better. Fire damage. Eh, still not good. Let's back away, not slowly, but back away. Hurt him. Biff's gonna take some fire. That's cool.
my dead eye continues to look like a boss. Because that's his job. To be a boss. That went actually pretty well. I'm okay with that. A little bit ticked off I didn't pick up that elite deadhead, though. I was pretty, pretty happy with that. Approach excavators. Good journeys to you. Good journeys to you too. Strange skull we unearthed. I'll take the skull, why not? Those guys clearly are not meant to be part of my crew. Okay, so... Ah, cool. Okay, so we have that whole book. So ask about the machine gods. Techno priest, blah de blah de blah de blah de blah. Okay. Sure, tell me what Kronon. Cool, so this is actually some of the fluff for the game. Creek's Marine. Geyer. Div. So forgive me if you don't like the, the fluff for this, but this is actually kind of cool if you want to take a look at this and, and read through it at the same time. Spartax. I guess I'll leave. I kind of thought I'd be able to give him... What is that? There's the, the book. The book with the cog. But apparently I can't, which is kind of annoying. What I think I will do is I will see these last little POIs real quick, and then I will... Aw, poor guys. POIs, and then I will save this particular one. Approach this dude. Why are you out here, big guy? Is he some sort of bounty hunter? Looking for my brother. Come on board. Seems in nails. Wrong one. There we go. Alright, another frontliner? These guys are just worthless to me. Like, actually less than worthless. Oh well. Last POI, then I call it quits for the moment. Okay, they're gathered to worship. We'll approach them. Aha! Offer the Book of the Cog. Sisters is quest on the ridge of their cell. She's shunned the Fair Creek's machine. Yes, bring it to her. And apparently she wants to kill us. Because apparently saying, hey buddy, it's just not in her nature. So I have a trencher, I have Biv, and I have Kristog, who I want to call Kellogg. I really do. Holy mother. She's an elite Deadeye. Hooray! All right, here we go, boys. We're dropping the distillery on her. You're gonna run forward and take people out. Level up. 
I think I just picked myself up a an elite Jedi. But I'm gonna pick up some of this other stuff in the meantime Power. too. Play for time. Ah oh, no. Biv, survive. All right, Biv, you're okay. And I, I may not care so much about elites because they're so big, but you know, I care about them somewhat. Hooray! Cool. So now I have an elite dead eye. How awesome is that? I didn't even know they existed. I'm guessing there was somebody else I could have picked up that one way the heck from before. Cool, though. Alright, she has crazy amounts of damage already. She might become us a staple in my groups. Six to seven already. She actually shoots farther than everybody else. She has a pathetically low move, but I can deal with that, you know? Not what I meant to do. But folks, that is all the time we have for this particular episode as always thank you so so much for the support you've been showing the channel uh feel free to leave love comments you know, constructive criticisms let's not be mean and i will see you guys next time with sky shines bedlam this is connell work signing off take it easy